हेलो चिल्ड्रन वेलकम बैक टू स्टोरी टाइम विद मिस निधि टुडे आई हैव अ वेरी स्पेशल स्टोरी फॉर ऑल ऑफ अस टू रीड टुगेदर एंड द टाइटल ऑफ द स्टोरी इज द कोयल विद द सोर थ्रोट एंड इट इज पब्लिश बाय प्रथम बुक्स द ऑथर ऑफ द स्टोरी इज माला कुमार Come, let's listen to the story and see what Parvez and Stella are doing in the classroom. It looks they are having lots of fun in the classroom. It is a lovely day in June. Mira Miss is busy. She has told the children to play on their own. Stella and Parvez are having fun drawing on the blackboard. And see, I can see they are drawing some funny, fun stuff on the blackboard. कोयल कोयल परवेज यस बट इट सीम्स टू हैव अ सोर थ्रोट आई हैव नेवर सीन अ कोयल विद अ सोर थ्रोट बिफोर कम लेट्स गो लुक फॉर इट से स्टेला एंड सी व्हाट दे आर अप टू स्टेला एंड परवेज रन टुवर्ड्स द ट्रीज दिस पिट इज टू डीप आई कांट जंप ओवर इट Say Stella. So what Parvez did? He held her hand and they leapt across. Cuckoo! Calls out Stella. Cuckoo! Oo! Whispers Parvez. They look everywhere, but they can't find the bird with the sore throat. Soon, all their classmates join them in their search. Cuckoo! Cuckoo! Everybody wants to see the coil with the sore throat. There, there, says Bhanu. No, no, here, says Zeba softly. I can see on that branch, says Uma. Parvez, look up on the tree, says Karan. Oh no, oh no! How do we know which one has a sore throat? Asks Zeba. Tun 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 tun. Lunch time! Yells Bhanu. Parvez can feel his stomach growling. What is that sound? Jokes Stella. They run inside and open their lunch boxes. Idli! Yay! Say Stella happily. Hmm hmm. Pa pa th th tha. Mumbles Parvez. Munching a paratha. Tun 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 tun. Lunch break is over. Parvez picks up his bag and runs to Amina Dadi. She is waiting near the gate. Parvez, you are not wearing your hearing aid. You know it will help you hear better, dear. She says. She pulls the small machine out of his shirt pocket. I da 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 don't. La 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 like it he mutters and i don't like my glasses but i wear them don't i asks dadi just then he hears a coil faintly ku u u u ku u u u imitates parvez with a giggle ku u u parvez tells dadi about the coil with a sore throat as they walk towards sukarna school for the deaf in the evening he meets stella near his house stella i heard the coil he says one word at a time stella waves both her hands in the air it means she is clapping parvez has taught her many words in sign language words that he has learned from sheila miss at sukarna school i the th- th- thing I- I- it's the the throat g- g- got b- better he says sheila miss says his voice too will get better it may just take a long time catch calls parvez and off he runs it is play time now so children some years are different some children are special they are little more special so would you want to know about parvez let me tell you about parvez listen carefully 
When Parvez was just five months old, his parents saw that he didn't react to loud noises at all. They took him to a doctor who said that Parvez may have hearing loss. The doctor explained how they could help Parvez learn everything just like children who can hear. When you can hear well, you learn to speak easily too. Most deaf people do not speak very well because they cannot hear others talk. People who have total hearing loss cannot hear anything. Parvez has partial hearing loss, so he needs a special teacher like Sheila Miss to help him learn sign language, lip reading and other ways of communicating. You know what is sign language? In sign language, we use our hands and facial gestures to communicate and in lip reading, children who cannot hear, they are taught how to read the lips of the other person when they are talking to make sense of the words. Some people wear glasses so that they can see better. Parvez wears a hearing aid so that he can hear better. He has to be careful with this little machine. Parvez understands people better when they speak to him softly and if they are facing him when they speak. Parvez cannot hear well but he can see, feel, smell, understand and learn very well and he even plays catch very well. So children, if you ever have a friend like Parvez in your class, be very respectful to your friend and help your friend to listen to you carefully by doing what? By trying to learn sign language from your friend. By talking to your friend softly so that your friend can make sense out of what you are talking to him or her and always face them while talking to them. Alright, I am sure you all will take care of all your special friends in your class and in your community and be respectful to your special friends. So this brings me to the end of the story and I will take your leave and I will meet you again with another story. Could be a fun story, could be a learning story. Till then, tata, bye bye. See you.